As I looked deep into my own eyes, the woman in the mirror and I had a reckoning. I asked myself, are you sure about your choice to martyr yourself for your children? Mothers have been martyring themselves in their children's name since the beginning of time. We have been trained to prove our love by ceasing to exist. What a terrible burden for children to bear, to be the reason their mother ended her life and to know that their mother locked herself away so they will never really know her. To learn that if they choose to become mothers, this will be their fate too. If we show our children that being a martyr is the highest form of love, that is what they will become. They will feel obligated to love as well as their mothers loved, after all. And they will believe they have permission to live only as fully as we allow ourselves to live. As Jung suggested, there is no greater burden on a child than the unlived life of a parent. What if a responsible mother is not one who slowly dies in her children's name and calls that love? What if a responsible mother is one who shows her children how to fight to stay wildly alive until the day she dies? Right there on the floor, I looked deep into my own eyes and I let the knowing rise and stay. My children do not need me to save them. My children need to see me save myself.